You're watching Southern Cross News. Once school holidays were considered boring, but that seems to be a thing of the past. Around 200 people saw kids show off their talents on bikes and scooters as part of a first-time event in Port Lincoln. As a DJ plays some cool tunes, children get their skates on for some school holiday fun. From boys on skateboards to others who prefer pedal power, there was no better place to be. When we came here for a site visit first thing this morning, there were already kids here getting ready. People lined the bowl to see scooter riders show off their moves as part of the four hour long event. And they were absolutely terrified to start with um, and then our coaches warmed them up and got them to drop in, taught them a few tricks. Encouraging children to enjoy sport is just one way to combat obesity. It helps get them away from the video games and outdoors and action sports are starting to replace traditional sports as a form of activity. So what do the critics think? It was pretty good and fun and I enjoyed myself. Well, I thought it was pretty fun because there was lots of stuff to do. And there was jams and stuff and th this doesn't re really happen that often so yeah, it was pretty fun. Everyone gets to come together and catch up with their friends. It's all part of the Big Air School Desert to Sea Tour, travelling right around regional SA. I suppose tours like ours that provide them the opportunity to show off their skills to the local communities. A new water fountain for thirsty kids was unveiled yesterday. It was made possible by a $2,000 donation raised by Saypol's Valentine Blue Light Ball. Sophie Lawson, Southern Cross News.